Today, for the first time, all 50 states have at least partially emerged from lockdown. But as we get back to work, who gets the blame if someone gets sick? Kayla Tausch is looking at that issue in our States of Play survey. Kayla. Hey, Tyler, who shoulders that liability is one of the key questions facing lawmakers as they try to craft the next phase of congressional relief. But the answer isn't so clear cut, according to our latest CNBC and Change Research survey conducted over the weekend in six critical battleground states. In that survey, 45 percent of respondents said that employees and customers should be able to sue a company if the virus spreads there. That's the position backed by Democrats. 42 percent of respondents said businesses should be protected from lawsuits suits over the spread of the virus. That's the position held by most Republicans. The rest of respondents say they're not quite sure who should be blamed. Of course, pinning the virus on a particular establishment would require large-scale contact tracing so that people's whereabouts can be accurately tracked. And Americans aren't completely sold on that idea quite yet. More voters in these swing states say they are not willing to share their data to allow their whereabouts to be tracked. 14 percent say that they are on the fence about that. Of course, most officials hope that if there is another future outbreak in some of these cities, that they happen in small clusters so that invasive technology isn't needed. But of course, we don't know whether or when any second wave would take place and how some of the data will look after these reopenings.